Welcome, welcome, welcome! Welcome back. Should we just keep the monocolored train rolling and do this Grey Merchant? Grey Merchant. That's what I'm literally, I'm in my head, I'm like, it's totally a sign, dude. Uh, Gary didn't wheel in our literal, our literal first draft. I also really like this Chandra. I also think Plow Under is top tier. I'm going to take the Grey Merchant, guys. And we're going to hope to live the mono black dream. You know why? I don't know. Collective Brutality, I guess? Seems fine. R R R Reggie and the Jets. Oh, big Liliana? That makes me feel real good about this. About this, these black picks. I bet Glensleeve Siphoner comes back. Alright, this guy's coming right back in. We don't let our memes be dreams. We let our memes be memes. B -b -b Benny and the Jets. What are we gonna take? Night Veil vale, Spectre, yeah. Night Veil vale, Spectre in the Mono Black deck seems pretty legit. I bet Murderous Red Cap. I bet Liliana's Mastery is 100% coming back. This is a late fourth pick Primeval Titan, though. Can you do five color super guns in this cube? I don't know, actually. What's my favorite Creed song? It, um, Probably with arms wide open. With arms wide open. Under the. Welcome to this place. I don't know why. It's so scary to me that I still know the Creed song lyrics. You know what I mean? Oh, wow. Not a single black card. That's rough. That's rough. I'll take Compulsive in case we're blue-black. Because Compulsive is real strong. And we have a Nightfell Spectre, so... My favorite, my favorite Creed son is the one where the stop singing. That's barely... You're, that's barely English, buddy. <laughs> I like that you're like, well, I messed up. That's uh, that's my bad, guys. Oh, Skin Render. Look how I got excited about Skin Render, not because it's a fantastic card, but because that dude has two black pips on him. Ooh! I got the Hangerback Walker parody song, and I can't think of the original song's name. Ain't no Hangerback Walker. Uh, I just, I sing it to the Hangerback Girl by Gwen Stefani. I don't know if that's what other people do, but that's what I do. Unbear Rights could be good if we actually find a way to splash. Give me those pips. Put, 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 pips. Tide Hollow Scholar? I guess we could just take Golos, right? Golos is just basically a five mana Solemn Simulacrum. That's a three five instead. No, Gwen Stefani does Hanger Bag Girl. Oh god, my... Oh god, the stream is dying right now. I'm so sorry, everybody. <sighs> I'm sorry, everybody. I love you. I'll be back one day. Remember me. I will remember you. Will you remember me? 
Don't let your memes pass you by. Please start streaming again. Please reconnect. Please! Oh, the concealed courtyard. There we go. I have no idea what just happened. That was... That was a thing. Crater Hoof? We could have Primal Titan and Crater Hoof. That ain't right. You said you were just getting a cigarette, cigarettes at the store. Yeah, well, you know what? I never loved you. I'm going to take Kalidus. I like this concealed courtyard because you can basically play it just as a... as a free way to cast this again. The, the worst part about playing mono black is that you pass so many good cards in order to play mono black. You're like, well, I can't cast this guy. I guess I'll take Graveyard Marshal. That's just kind of sad. Yurt, <sighs> it's okay. We'll make it through this together, buddy. We're going to do it. I think it is just Graveyard Marshal. We could take Mere Battle Sphere or On Color Signet. I think it's just mere battle sphere. Uh, Life Bane might be better than Finale, and Finale will come back. Coalition Relic actually does make it possible to splash things a lot easier. 100% Elder Spell? I actually like Coalition Relic a lot just because we took mere battle sphere. I'm going to take Coalition Relic. It's also just a fantastic card. I'll take Vampire Hex Mage. That's two pips. I really want to. I really want a, uh, what's it called? You know the one. Crux of Fate seems good here. Um, Crexian Arena, that's what I'm looking for. Get them pips. I'm trying, buddy. I'm trying. You almost have as many views as Bernie Sanders, and he. Does Bernie Sanders have ice cream? Dang. I need to get ice cream. Wasn't Pip the dude from Great Expectations? I think he was also from Lord of the Rings. You think it was the same guy? Nighthawk. Yes. God, no one gets excited about Nighthawks unless you're the mono black deck. Thank you. you want an ice cream cake? Curry, dude, I always want ice cream cakes. Or like a carrot cake. Oh, carrot cake sounds delicious. One star peeps, five star games. Thanks so much for the reset, buddy. Welcome back. That is a solid number of resubs. I really appreciate you. Or just like a rich ass chocolate cake, man. I could go for some cake, dude. That's a super fat thing to say, but you know what? I haven't had cake in like ages, dude. Like actual cake, not necessarily ice cream cake, but I'm gonna go find. I'm gonna go find some carrot cake. Staff of Nin. It's kind of like Frexian Arena. Oh, dude, those rich-ass chocolate cakes, those are, like, the best, dude. Where it's, like, layer a little bit of cake, and then there's, like, a thick-ass layer of fudge frosting, and then it's, like, layer of cake, and then it's, like, thick-ass layer of frosting. I'm like, that's... That's gonna put me in a food coma. I think it's Staff of Nin, and maybe Hypnotic Spectre comes back. I think Staff... I just love Staff. And we have Relic, so it's, like... That's cool. Carrot Cake is also the jam. Some people will shit on carrot cake. They're like, I don't want fruit and raisins in my cake. And I'm like, buddy, you don't even understand. You have an un unreasonable... An unreasonable view of, of your of your cake expectations. Friendly FFS, thank you so much for the resub, buddy. Really appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, dude. 
I had carrot cake at my wedding. Shit is delicious. That's a classy move. That's a solid move right there, the carrot cake wedding. I also, I think I prefer pie to cake too. I think, I think in general, I'm a bigger fan of pies than cakes. But... Well, this is a, this is a shit pack. Take a quarantine feel, I guess. I don't know. I don't know, man. You got me. Really wish the stream would stop. Would stop dying. That would be great. I'm so sorry, guys. Shambling Veld, Elder Spell, and Graveyard Marshal came back. I'm going to take... I think Elder Spell is fine. Lifebane Zombie did come back, just as predicted. Let's see if that Hypnotic Spectre also rolls on back. Roll on back. Slaughter Pact. Not unplayable. Sundering Titan? Well. Kaya's Guile. We could splash that, dude. And we could splash that if we need to. We have Concealed Courtyard and Coalition Relic now. That moment where you feel like it's just all coming together. Do we just take Damnation and then hope this guy wheels? Because this guy's going to wheel, right? The problem is if he doesn't wheel, it's so bad. Because he's so good right now. I don't think I'm risking it. Oh, and a Gonti? Oh, yes. These are two top-tier picks that we're getting right here. I don't think anyone else is taking them, but, like, someone could just, like, be like, oh, there's nothing else for me in this pack. I could take this. Erebus. Erebus. Shieldred? And Ultimate Price. Ooh. We don't actually have a ton of removal here. We have, like, literally Skin Render and Collective Brutality and Shitty Slaughtered Pack. I'm going to take the ultimate price. We do also have a Crux of Fate in the sideboard. Sometimes you just need to kill a dude. Oh, we can also just take this Languish, too. We can also take Orzhov Signet, which is not bad. Amit Eternal is actually pretty good. I like Orzhov Signet here, I think. I think we're taking the Orzhov Signet. Not only does it let us uh, flashback unbarrel rights, it also just lets us cast our four drops earlier. And Golos can actually get our Concealed Courtyard, which is kind of nice. <gasps> Packrat. I think we just Packrat here. Packrat, we can discard unbarrel rights. We can discard, like, Massacre or, or Mirror Battlesphere to get it back later with unbarrel rights. Yeah, we're just taking Packrat here. I'm a fan. Wow, this pack is hot trash. I'm just going to hate this Woodfall Primus. Uh, take Gideon. <laughs> Chat might be way behind. You guys might want to refresh. Refresh. 
Murderous Cut, Knight's Whisper, and Freebooter? Oh boy. I will play Murderous Cut a thousand times over Slaughter Pact. I also just love Knight's Whisper. I actually hate Slaughter Pact. I think it's trash. More like Trash Pact. I hate I hate free I, I just don't like freebooter I just don't think it's that good I think we just might need the removal I do think we need that also that's fine Sure. None of these are great. Wow. Dragon Lord of Tarka? Jeez. Anguished? Okay. Condemn? Okay. Alright, well I guess this is our deck. Last pick Woodfall Promise? Jesus. Also, like, I mean, with Concealed Courtyard, Coalition Relic, and Orzhov Signet, we have a good amount of ways to to get a white source for this. Unbarrel Rights, or if we need to, like, Splash, Anguished Unmaking, or Kaya's Guile, or Forsake, or something. We also do have Nykthos, don't forget. I don't know if you, maybe you didn't forget, but you just might not have seen that we picked this bad boy up. I'm actually going to keep Mute Vault out, just because... Obliterator. I don't want to be in a situation where I draw Mutavolt and, and Nick those, and I just can't cast Obliterator. Let's do it. And we have Elder Spell for the sideboard, so. Just make sure everything is good. Yes, 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 yes. yes. That seems good. I do wish we had... Oh, this hand is good. I do wish we had um, like a Ravenous Chupacabra or a Shriekma or something. Some kind of creature that we can destroy other creatures with. A creature to end all creatures. And that's not bad. That's funny because we can actually add blue with Night Veil Spectre. We have Concealed Courtyard add white. And then Coalition Relic we can put a counter on and remove the counter for green. And then tap it for red to activate Golos. That's actually funny. That's ridiculous. Now that's pod racing. <laughs> you ain't kidding. Now that's pod racing. Buddy, you right. What do I have to do? What do I have to do? So what is this? One, two, three, four, five, six mana? Fucking seriously? Come on. Should have just played things pre-combat. The reason you don't is because if you hit a land off their stuff or something, then you get to do cool things, but... Well, oh, this guy's getting countered for sure. So you need like Tireless Pilgrim, Coalition Relic, Night Veil Spectre, Nykthos, and Golos, and Concealed Courtyard. So it's a six card combo. Yeah, that seems good. 
Why not have Fumigate? Oh my god, it's so exhausting, dude. Wait, did he not? Can he not bounce artifacts? Why would you not bounce my coalition relic there? One, two, three, four, five, six. Unfortunate. I've been putting the MTGO Legacy Cube together. It was I was not prepared. Yeah, no, I know that feeling where you're like, oh, you probably only need a few cards for this, and then you actually need like 50 cards, and then it's just too late. Well, let's see what you got here. Chandra, oh, and you have three red cards and zero red mana. Uh huh. What in the fudge? I mean, unfortunately, they can just cast Nicol Bolas. They bounce Lifebane Zombie, and then they can cast Nicol Bolas. This is all very strange. Sure. You can get rid of one of my removal spells. Do they play... black so we need your whole hand right so we have four five six so we can literally do this right play you for four add four five no we don't have the mana for that right because it's going to cost two extra but we're netting four yeah, we're netting four we're losing two right so one two three four five. one two add four five we're too shy too shy shy Battle sphere, I die. I mean, this feels good. I'm also too shy. <laughs> hush, hush, I do I. Oh, yeah, bounce that token. You got it. Wow, those are some good draws. All things considered, when your hand is absolutely hot trash, these are some these are some solid draws. We're definitely bringing in like anguish stun making, and do they not have a way to crack that to get a 
red source. This is all very strange. That's obnoxious because like we know they don't have like anything in their hand. Like we know it's Nickel Bull Chandra, right? Why do we even do this? Yeah, we know. For some reason, I thought they had a different card in their hand. Get there, I guess. That was stupid. We should just actually have them lose two. We gained two. We just held it. Oh, wow. Hmm. So they need a red source or a black source to cast Nicol Bolas here. Let's see how lucky they are. Oh, well. Kind of lucky. It's like half lucky. Lucky, 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 lucky. Okay. What does our Chandra do? They definitely don't want to deal. They definitely don't want to use Chandra, so. All these are terrible. Path to Exile, and they have no... It's just going to take Opt. Unimpressive Opt. Bottom. That's not bad if we can... Teferi, Teferi, your face, your face. If we had one more mana... Actually, we could have... No, we could have done that. We could have played that. Yeah, we should have played Erebus that turn. I forgot about the Nykthos. I got pretty I got pretty disheartened by the uh are they gonna play Chandra? There's no way they deal three to everything, right? And then sack three permanents. That's interesting. Just go to three planes. All right, works for me. Why wouldn't you do that before? Oh, because you couldn't. Yeah, I gotcha. I gotcha. Yeah, I wish we played Airbus last turn. For real. And we also didn't... Oh, God, we're so tilted right now. I'm so sorry, guys. Yeah, we just wasted a ton of mana. We could have drawn like three cards this turn. You got it. Really? I mean, drawing Doomfall and Chandra so you actually have exactly enough to get rid of my board is pretty good for you. All right.
indestructible. How nice. Oh boy. It's round one. God, this game really really got out of hand here. Alright, so I'm just gonna play Nickel Bolus now, finally. Yep. Why do you have this many planes in your four color deck? I hope they try to destroy Airbus, that'd be just great. Just fantastic. <laughs> wow. Wow, that's amazing. That's that's incredible. Yep, that's amazing. Alright, bringing in the Anguished, bringing in the Forsake. We're also going to bring in two planes just for the hell of it. Kaya's Guile. Elder Spell seems great here. Take out the ultimate price, take out a Murderous Cut. Mask Form still could be good. Yeah, we can we can stick with this. Gideon's double blue. I'm not really. Let's keep this. Come on, one time. I was like, are you gonna, are you gonna counter this? You got four spike? My man. Yes. Yes. Well, this is a turn turn four mirror battle sphere. That's pretty spicy. I still don't understand this strategy. Oh wow, that's really good. Is that better? My cake has arrived? Oh my god, hold on a second guys. All right, well, they're going to bounce this guy, sure. Jesus. This is my life. This is Kerwich just sending me random things. It's, it's like two boxes. What's even going on here? I still don't understand not bouncing the Coalition Relic. Alright, 
put a charge counter on this guy. That seems good. Can easily just cast this and see what they have, right? Four, five, six. <laughs> I'm just still laughing at this cake delivery, man. Come on. Well, how are you, real? I mean, we're definitely plussing this. We might forsake this, but I don't think it's worth it. Because they have, like, lots of banishing light type things. Four, five, six. Yeah, I literally think we're just playing this guy here. And what if they have, like, a mana leak, though? It seems bad, right? Fumigate and four lands? Oh boy. I'm just going to play this guy because he draws a card here. And they're going to plus Teferi to three, so we just get to kill, to get the one shot Teferi next turn, which is super nice. I got to find a, a cutting device for this bag. Yeah, you got it. All right, hold on, hold on one second, guys. Let me just. I'm using like this. I could just reach over and get scissors. I'm just gonna use the knife on this thing. All right, we got some cheesecake. It looks like with some raspberry drizzle. I would assume a nice little cheesecake here. We have a slice of chocolate cake, looks like, with some powdered sugar on the top. That seems pretty nice. And we have this thing, which looks delicious. I have no idea. This is like a German chocolate cake kind of thing. I have no idea. Kurt literally is just like, here, let me get you three slices of cake and send them to you. And that's where we are right now. Oh my god. <laughs> so that's good. That's where we're that's where we're at. Peanut butter? Oh my god, dude, you are a maniac. You are the best kind of maniac. Kurt, you are the hero this stream needs. Guess we'll just play Kalidus. Get that time raveler. This is where they just draw like the removal spell. No? Teferi just goes to the garbage can? Alright. Be the change you want to see in the world. I might just have some of this now, I'm gonna be honest with you. Because that's the kind of... That's the kind of stream this is. Official cake eating stream, guys. Magma Jet on... Sure. I can't deal with that. That is a thick ass chocolate cake. You are right. You ain't kidding. Do we think they'll have settle? Do we care? Five, six, seven, eight. This is a nice little combo.
One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, I'll just pass here. What did they play last turn? Mana Confluence? All right. So we know two of their four cards. Okay, while you eat cake, I need to run and get beaten up by my trainer. Nice. That's This seems counterproductive, I'm going to be honest with you. You're sending me cake, but you're getting training. Okay, well, I think we're just, I think this game's over. That's a Lord of Luxury right there. So they have to kind of block with Lava Claw Reaches here, but we can just, can't do anything, I guess. Can't anguish them making it or forsake it. Hmm. Well, that's something, isn't it? I guess you got me. Give me one of them sweet, spicy planeswalkers. Nothing? Dang, they didn't like that at all. They were like, no. Snap keep. Never gonna give you up. Never gonna. Wow. All right. That's enough. That's enough high ends, guys. Never gonna run around. I mean, I know they have fumigate, which is kind of scary. Never gonna give, never gonna give. No black source damnation, I guess. They've drawn Fumigate all three games as well, so maybe this is the one game they don't draw it. Sure. That's fine. Am I being rickrolled by a straw? I'm like, I was like, oh wait, I am singing. I am singing Never Gonna Give You Up right now, aren't I? I'm wondering how this got in my head. You condemn this guy? <whistles> Very aggressive. Staff of Nin next turn seems pretty powerful. That's a powerful wizard. So is Nickel Bolas. I almost just want to play Massacre Room to, to deal with it. But then they just kill Mask Worm, right? So. And I overpaid because I'm a dummy. Gerwitt did desert you. Wow, that's hilarious.
Sure. Oh, Lord. Well, that's terrifying because we discarded Mirror Battle Sphere, so. That's not great. Actually, maybe it's not that bad. Snickerbolus is still very powerful. It's a very powerful wizard. Excuse me. The problem is they're like just not gonna. We're so close, dude. I mean, they just kill this now, and then they can, and then they can bring it back. Like, I just don't know how we're gonna deal the extra two points, unfortunately. What? This is all very strange. I mean, getting Grey Merchant back is just insane here, right? That's interesting. No, Knight's Whisper doesn't target. We need to sign in blood. What the f- Why- Wait, what? You gotta have like a- You're going to one. Sure. Oh, I 
I mean, they they have Grey Merchant. They have they have they have lots of things. I'm not gonna play it. That's ugh. Yeah, Merchant gained six from Scarab God and Nickel Bolas. It's pretty brutal. I wonder if we actually... I don't know, man. Like, if they didn't bring back Grey Merchant, but, like, we just kill them with Collector Brutality? Like, is that... Is that a thing? Sure. They're gonna take Signet. They probably think it's our only white source and we're splashing white. <laughs> I'm just going to play that for the rubbins. Joke's on you, dummy. <laughs> yeah, it's just a matter of, like, we can just sit here and get beat up for the next ten minutes or we can just go to the next game. I mean, he basically lost to Nickel Bolas in that game. Pretty single-handedly. Just like mono is this mono black on mono black because that's pretty funny Yes, we boarded an Elder Spell that match. Woo, my throat. God, the life, the life gain, guys. The life gain. All right, don't languish. Don't languish me, bro. Don't crux of fate me, bro. Oh, Tamio? That's okay. You're gonna draw two? Tamio has a divination? Because otherwise she dead. You gotta tap this guy down. Yeah, Tamio has divination. Seems good. Five mana divination prevent two. Attack Tamio, attack your... Attack your face. Attack your face. And all right, that's the game. That's the game. And that's the way the news goes. I don't think we need anything yet. Uh, none of our removal is like non-black creature. Lifebane zombie seems pretty bad. I actually could see Borden like anguished on making for Planeswalker. Another white source. This is like still five white sources. One, two, Courtyard, Coalition Relic, Golos. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I'm going to mulligan this hand. Even though Packrag could just win it for us. Oh, we're keeping this for sure. Come on, two drop. That's not a two drop at all. 
<clears throat> Yikes. Big staffs. Three drop, two drop or three drop? Give me something to play. Oh, that's getting anguished on making for sure. Well, now we got something to play. Followed by Big Blitz. Followed by Skin Rendy. Thirteen life. I don't mind the goofiness in the names. I don't take magic too seriously. I feel like it's just this guy. This this doesn't do anything now, this doesn't do anything. We can skin render and kill this, and in response they shoot us. If we kill this, it's fine, but then they can try I don't know. <clears throat> Yikes. Oh, well we got staffing in. I ain't I ain't scared. For all your strength, you have nothing to threaten. What if I threaten you with my strength? Well, that's... Wow, that's next level. What are you shooting? My face? But I didn't even... I didn't even target it yet. Oh. Oh, alright. Yeah, that's fine. I basically traded a skin render for a vampire hex mage and a walking ballista. And that's just fine. <laughs> that's just fine. Wow. Now you're just being rude. Alright, well. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh god. Oh, that guy's pretty good. Oh, it's awkward I can't play both of these guys because of the the stupid... Because it's literally six black and the Orzhov signet doesn't allow us. Huh. One, two, three, four. I think it's still Obliterator here. We can fade a turn. Wow, had I known they were gonna drop Grave Titan, I would have definitely waited on the fuck on the vamp on the mask worm. Wait, really? Oh, I guess we'd have to sack like six permanents for that. Or they'd have to they have to sack six, which is like 
two zombie. This guy doesn't even die. Hmm. I think we just take six here. Is that good? I mean, it's actually terrible. But I think it's fine because we can play both Nighthawk and Aetherborn next turn. Both of which are really good at blocking a Grave Titan. <clears throat> six, seven, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, so we're going to play Nighthawk. So that's a lot of life gain. I'm pretty okay with that. Yeah, but he takes. But he could just easily sack like a bunch of lands too. I don't know. We have one, two, three blocks. So we take one, two, three, four, five, six. But we're gaining a lot. We're just hoping that. Oh, and they also got a twelve. So. Yeah, just take five here. All we have to do is survive their top deck. That's it. That's all you gotta do. All right, this is what we figured they'd do. Maybe our attack was really greedy. Oh, we just win the game. Okay, well, that'll do, I guess. That'll do. is great but not great I'm gonna keep this I'm gonna ship a land here it's greedy <sighs> can't maybe not actually I can probably ship pack rat we can go either born and delete this into yeah I'll ship pack rat click clack click I got a yeah I got a new keyboard so so in your face. In your face, David. Got him. Got him. He's going to need to go to the infirmary room after that. Josh, I went with the G915, which is another Logitech wireless keyboard. Are you going to counter this? Holy shit, you have no soul. You are actually a soulless urchin of a human being. Forced to live out your life in misery. Oh, look at this little dirt, dirt burgle. Come at me, bro. Give me a land. Just give me a land so I can play Kalidas and the Grey Merchant. Don't do me dirty. Well, that's actually not terrible. <clears throat> yeah, actually, Felipe works at Best Buy. And so he picked it up for me with... You know, you know, things. Hmm. 
what Switch is, there's three different versions. There's a clicky version, which is like MX Cherry Blues. Cherry MX Blues. MX Cherry Blues? It's, they're like the blues. There's a tactile version, um, which is kind of like reds, I think. And then there's a... Um, there's another version. I forgot what the other version was. Linear. I wanted to say linear, but I was like, that doesn't make sense for a keyboard. Yeah, this is the clicky version because I wanted it to mirror. Like, I'm a big fan of MX Blues. And I like the clicky the clicky sound. It's very pleasant to my ear hole. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Sure, we take 10 here, but... Then you have nothing to threaten us with. Oh, they're keeping this guy. Oh, no, they're not. I can't tell if they're winning either. I don't know what's going on. One, two. <clears throat> so we can add four. We'll have six mana. We have so much life gain. Go to three. We're at twenty one, they're at three. I guess they just go mountain kiki jiki, right? So exhausting, dude. It's so exhausting. Oh boy. Never gets old. Guess I'll die. No, it's a matter of, like, whenever I get into a position where I'm like, wow, I'm doing really well, I just turned the corner, and they're at three, so there's no way I can lose. Um, that's the moment where I lose. So it's like, well, let's, what's the exact worst thing that can happen to me right now? And then that's the thing that happens. So...
when you don't know me anymore. I think this is actually totally fine, but I kind of just want to like. I kind of just want to steal this dude anyway, or like <clears throat> nug him for five. And then we get to draw a card. Sure. Sure. Also sure. So many sures. <clears throat> it's Frank's laser. Oh, Jesus. <clears throat> Sometimes you feel like I'm not. They took my gray merchant. At least with Grey Merchant, they could block. It's weird. Why would he do that? I don't know. <clears throat> Forsake gets rid of the um, the sword. Well, I don't think we really care about that. Elder Spell gets rid of Ral, but like it's kind of narrow. Might be better than Brutality. It's probably not, though, because, like, we can get rid of a spell and kill one of their creatures. What's this? What's this? I can't believe my eyes. Oh, man, we're talking about some serious mana production on turn five. If we survive... But you don't know me anymore. This work on Night Vale, they go bounce Night Vale. That was a good draw. I'll condescend this. I'll pay one mana for X. I'll censor your spell. Sure. Frost Titan Goblin Chain Whirler. This deck is so weird.
let's see what we got here. <clears throat> Exclusion Mage and Crater's Claws. He was a crater boy. He said, see you later, boys. <clears throat> All right. Guess we're dead soon. Take nine. No, I guess we could just kill this guy, right? That's why we take this crater as close. Hmm. So... So we can go four for this guy, and then Crater's Claws would deal two. Yeah, I don't think we can risk it, unfortunately. So next turn we can go Obliterator, Collective Brutality, Discard, like a Swamp. Seems totally fine. Probably just want to kill one of these guys, even though this guy's a 2-2, just because I don't want them to get this guy back. That's just worse in the future. Well, now I'll do it because you're giving me a chance to, so. I'm not going to waste a spell on it, but I'm also not going to just take infinite attacking damage, so. Here comes a Vendillion click. Which is nice because we now we have a really good target for the Collective Brutality if they don't want to take that. Or we'll just play Skin Render, so. That poor click has seen two hands and looked at death both times. You got it. What up, Valdez? Sure. <coughs> oh, we're just going to attack here. God, if we, can you imagine if we top deck, if they like exile their season pyromancer, we can top deck. Mm -hmm. Well, that's pretty good. Just attacking with both. If you want to trade one for one, that's fine. They did not want to do that. We got a lot of permanents.
I'm killing one of these because with Staff of Nin and two creatures on board and we're only at eight, like, that's actually a pretty decent clock. Myself and a good friend loves watching you. Wish I could watch more, but catch all your stuff on YouTube. We are both going to be in Florida in business in November. If it worked out, we would love to buy you and my car up dinner. If that's super weird. Oh, that's not worried at all, man. That's not weird at all. Uh, oh, my stomach is actually killing me right now. Why are you doing this stomach? Is it the cake? Was, was I poisoned? All right, let's see. Well, we're at virtual five here. Yeah, definitely, it's popcorn bag. Send an email for sure. Okay, I guess we're dead. Once they shoot you in the face with the staff of Nin to put you to five, they got you. So, thank you guys for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Hope you guys enjoyed these Vinthys Modern Cubes. And uh, you can find me at patreon.com slash franklapore, twitch.tv slash franklapore. Okay, that's three more damage to my face, to my beautiful visage. Oh. Huh. Well, we're not dead. And that's important. So if they block here, they take four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So they block here, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. They bounce here, block here. Yep, and they got blink. Oh, great. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Oh, magic. They go to one. They just block here, they sack six permanents. That's amazing. <laughs> so funny. So fucking funny. Like, I would have rather you just had a burn spell so I would have been dead instead of, like... Instead of a braid so that I actually feel like I'm not dead. And then I just have to lose to Inferno Titan multiple times in the same draft. Anyway, like I said, thank you guys for watching. Really appreciate it. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. I'll see you guys next time.